So here are some snippets from my travel to and first week in Chambéry. I flew overnight from Charlotte to Munich, then missed my flight from Munich to Zurich, got on another flight from Munich to Zurich on a tiny little plane. Somehow I got on the right train from Zurich to Geneva, and it was an awesome, beautiful three-hour ride. Then one of my classmates had to pick me up in Coulouse about an hour north of Chambéry because I think I got on the wrong train at Geneva, and she saved my life. I made it to the hotel, and now I'm moving in. My first ever day in France was a blur of getting from the hotel to, um, to my dorm, moving into my dorm, finding my way across Chambéry to get to the train station, get on a bus that takes 20 minutes to get to campus, get to campus, meet with some professors, and then go back. <laughs> it was a little chaotic. Here I am for f -talk. Dripped out. After a chaotic and stressful couple first days, I finally got to kind of explore Chambéry, went to my first French cafe, ordered coffee, made a fool of myself, couldn't really speak very well, but somehow managed to get around. And as soon as I get the lay of land somewhere, you know, I start running to try to explore. Here is the bike path that goes from Chambéry to the Porte du Lac campus where I go to school. And it's really rainy a lot of the time. Hills are alive, ooh, and there's a car. I'm starting to notice there's the beautiful countryside with all the little baby sheep and the mountains, and it also looks normal sometimes. Okay, now I'm going skiing. Ah. We could bury our shoes and wait for rain till the summer takes us home. Yeah, I spent most of that day falling, but it was really cool of them to let me come along. I hope I get to ski a bunch more this semester. The next day after skiing, I kind of had the day to myself and wanted to relax, so I took a hike. And being in the mountains, I literally got to start the hike in the town. Hiking here was a little different because it's the countryside, not the wilderness. So lots of crosses and farms and little towns along the way. This is on the Jura Mountain side looking over Chambéry. And I hiked for about 10, 12 miles that day. I didn't really keep track. And as I got home, there's a vaccine mandate protest going outside side of the town. It's been a wild first week. Um, I've had some really high highs. Exploring has been a lot of fun, but definitely I've also been exhausted and struggling with the whole language barrier thing. I'm excited to see what this whole semester has to bring. Um, I'm not sure how many more I'll make of these, but it was a lot of fun to look back at, so hopefully I'll have time to make some more. Till next time, ciao!